Hey everyone, it's Garth Predge with Free Online. Thanks for coming back. Uh, today, what we're going to do is have a look at some of the other bugs I've got in the house here. So, we're going to check out the blue death vein beetles. I want to sieve through all the sand and see if there's any eggs. Because I'm going to crack another crack at trying to get these things to pupate. They're almost impossible. I'll show you um, how the... <laughs> Dante's done. Hey, come here. Come here. Can you see it? Oh, he's there. In the camera. Oh, yeah. Anyway, um, I'll show you the um, rhinoceros beetles as well. So the um, Dynasties. Um, what have I got? Dynasties, Hercules, the Lychee. And see how their development's going. Um, they should, fingers crossed, be starting to gear up to pupate soon. So that's something that'll be wicked for the channel as well. I've got some pupil cells here so that I can pull them out and we can watch their development on the channel. That'll be amazing. But yeah, so stick around. Remember to hit that subscribe button if you like what I do and uh, check this out. So I'm not gonna weigh these today. These are the Dynasties, Lechi. There's quite a lot of fecal matter in there. But uh, I should be fine, so let's just tip this out. And there he is. There's one there. So they don't look like they've uh, grown that much, to be honest. So. Big bastards, isn't they? Fair play. Well, he's fine. Let's whack this back in here. There's some fecal pellets, but not that much. So I think he's going to be alright for a little bit. I've got. some more substrate uh, obviously because they use specialized substrate uh, so they'll be all right I want to see some massive ones where are they oh look at it he's not happy they uh, they have strong jaws and be able to give you a good nip Actually, I might change the substrate after this video now because there is quite a lot of, of fecals in there. Right, so that's number one, seven, four. Looks good. This one's number two. I think number two. Oh, there's a lot of fecal pellets in this one. All right, that's good. See these fecal pellets? You know that the subs they're eating the substrate if you find lots of shit, basically, isn't it? Then, where are you? There you are. Oh, this one's much, much bigger. And it's blowing off the substrate. Don't worry, it doesn't affect them at all. Make sure the sp spiracles are clear. One or two mites are not a problem with these. They're much, they're far. Uh, it's different to tarantula mites. Um, they don't unless they actually get so bad they clog up their spiracles, and that's the only time you have to really worry about uh, about these. Let's get this. Here. Look at that! They're monsters, man! They're monsters, and this one feels actually feels really heavy as well. Look 
God. They're looking to invite me. <laughs> See, they don't like being out in the light. But, uh, they're awesome, aren't they? That's a big one. Right, let's pop him back. Yeah, actually, you know what? I think this one will need to have uh, a change as well. So, I'll do, as I said, I'll do this after. What the fuck is that? Yes, yeah, so this one's quite saturated with fecal pellets. So, you're getting a substrate change as well. This was number three. This one's another beast one. Ah, I put that to this camera, you can't really see it, so I'll just use this one. And he is weighty as well, he actually feels quite heavy. Massive though, isn't he? So I think that would probably be about 50 grams, 60 maybe. Need to be about no more than that. Need to be about 120, and then they pupate. I think it's 120. This one's got a couple of mites on it, but nothing major. Happy with that. If we go back to one of my earlier videos, right? These guys, uh, it just exploded with mites, so it was really, 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 really a struggle, a huge struggle to try and get the, the level of mites down to this. But I'm really happy with that. And this one hasn't got that much poops in it. So I'll pop it back in. smallest one because this one where is he well, I can't see this one so this might be might be a dead one still lots of poos again in it Something like that there he is right so he's not dead absolutely is massive on this one but the body's not that big so I'm not sure if the substrate is rich enough for it. Come on buddy. The monsters though aren't they? Absolute monsters. Cheeky edit, this will be now a two part video, I've run on a little bit, I don't like to do videos over 10 minutes long, um, so this first one is going to be the the Beatles, as you've just seen, the Beatle larvae, the Dynasties, so the Rhino Beetle is the largest beetle in the world, not by by length, not by weight, uh, but by, by length they will be, the, be fucking huge. Thank you everyone who stuck with this video, I know this is a spider channel, but I do love other stuff. Um, and you know I love all animals but especially invertebrates, beetles, scorpions, centipedes, I love it all. Thank you for your patience, so uh, this will be a two part, two part, the next one will be next week, it's Friday today, um, Friday before my birthday so uh, don't expect videos over the weekend because <laughs> it ain't gonna happen. 
Uh, I am doing a live stream. It'll be tomorrow, uh, Saturday, uh, around the six o'clock mark. So five, six o'clock on Saturday, please. I'll make the, um, the, the post. Please share that and hit the reminder button so that you're reminded. Um, come join me. Um, maybe even Claire will be on the camera. Um, little cu couple of uh, couple of spiders out, and uh, we'll take questions.